and the winner is Quo Vadis Aida, Yasmila Zbanic. European cinema lovers, along with NEPs, chose the Bosnian film as the winner of the 2022 Lux Audience Award. Citizens and members each accounted for 50% of the vote. All three shortlisted films draw from historical events, but their subjects are extremely topical today, as we know too well about the disasters of an ongoing war in Ukraine and the plight of displaced people forced to flee for their safety. Quo Vardis Ida recounts the events of the massacre in Srebrenica, where Ida, a schoolteacher and UN translator, lives with her family. While supposedly under UN protection, more than 8,000 Bosnian Muslim civilians were murdered by Serbian forces. This film shows what are the consequences of war. Um, mothers of Srebrenica are still searching for more than 1,000 bodies of their sons. It shows how um, war, genocide, leaves consequences 30 years after. When General Ratko Mladic leads his Serbian troops into the city, Ida is recruited to help communication between evacuees and the UN. She becomes the witness of a failing peacekeeping mission. Colonel Karamans, they are killing people outside. I believe if we don't stop the war in Ukraine, we will have devastated Europe in a few years. So I really would like people to see the film and find a way to stop it. But Srebrenica happened because nobody stopped it. Quo Vadis Ida is a dilemma-filled thriller chronicling the horrors of 1995 and the failure of international institutions.